Hey everybody, I'm super excited to let you know about my brand new ProPresenter um, update to my MIDI cues for ProPresenter 7.6. So Renewed Vision just announced ProPresenter 7.6, um, which includes this brand new macros feature and in addition includes the ability to trigger ma macros via MIDI. So if you go to the MIDI screen in ProPresenter, uh, where you're probably used to living if you've ever done this before, you see we have a brand new MIDI command called trigger macros. Now, in order to use this MIDI cues file with this brand new feature, you need to make sure that your MIDI cues start at zero. So I always suggest people go up here to uh, the top here, hit zero and do autofill. We want to make sure that we go zero to five with messages being 28. And then we go all the way up to uh, 29 here. So we do 17 to 24, jump to 29, 25, 26, 27. So trigger macro, brand new cues, 29. If you leave your previous cues like this and open this new file, then everything's gonna continue to work. So you've gotta make sure your cues um, uh, have that correct information there. But uh, I've updated both the free version of this that goes up to 30 cues and we can scroll over here and you can see there's our new trigger macro command. Um, or if you are from studio to stage subscriber or you wanna purchase the full cues file, then uh, you can get all 127 cues available for that trigger macro command. And again, uh, trigger macro command is available in ProPresenter 7.6, which at the time of recording this is currently in public beta that you can test and use. So download this cues file, either the free one uh, or the paid one, uh, which is again, our full cues uh, zero to, or one to 127. Uh, download uh, ProPresenter 7.6, download these cues and try them out. If you're interested in either of these, both the free or the paid one, I've included links to download them in the description of this video. And if you wanna learn more about controlling ProPresenter uh, with Ableton Live, then check out From Studio to Stage where we have courses on um, all sorts of control and performance uh, things with Ableton Live, but in particular, how to control ProPresenter 6 and 7 via MIDI using Ableton Live. Thanks so much for watching everybody. Take care, bye-bye.